VidIQ is an amazing tool created to boost your YouTube channel's performance by increasing your views, subscribers, comments, and likes. Personally, I've used VidIQ to get over 190,000 lifetime views and 1,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. In this video, I'll show you how you can do the same. Throughout the tutorial, we'll look into VidIQ's extensive range of features, including their cutting-edge AI and ChatGPT powered features, and I'll show you exactly how I use it in my own content. Ready? Let's go. Before we start, please like, comment, and subscribe to join our community. I've been using VidIQ since I started on YouTube. In this video, I'll explain what VidIQ is and how I use it in my own content. But first, a disclaimer. I've seen creators on the platform promote this tool as some sort of silver bullet that will 10x your engagement on YouTube overnight. But I just want to say, this is just a tool. It's not the single factor responsible for a person's success or lack thereof on YouTube. There are two ways for a channel to get views and subscribers on YouTube. The first way, you create an awesome, well-edited, and entertaining video. YouTube then shows that video to more people and it keeps growing. This works great for entertaining channels, but I've seen educational channels do it too. The second way is through YouTube search. You make a video that appears when people search for a particular topic or question on YouTube. This is where VidIQ helps you out. It helps you make your video show up higher in search results by suggesting the best keywords for your video titles and descriptions. Of course, your video still needs to be good with a catchy thumbnail, good audio, and engaging content. This method is a bit slower, but it works 100% for tutorial-based channels like mine. VidIQ has a bunch of features but its primary selling point is that it is an SEO and keyword research engine. Here's how you use it. If you have a YouTube channel, just go to vidiq.com and sign in with your Google account. The free vision works great if you are just getting started. Once you are in, link your channel and you will have access to all of vidiq's features. You can also get the Chrome extension or mobile app for easy access. When you open vidiq for the first time, you will see stats like views, subscribers, and watch time if you've uploaded videos. You'll also find information about your subscribers, their demographic, and the best time to post. If you haven't uploaded anything yet, don't worry, these stats will fill up as you build your audience. Now the keyword search tool is where you start. Enter a potential video title and vidIQ will give you a scorecard. The search volume is how many people search for that keyword on YouTube each month. Higher is better. The competition is how many others are making videos on that topic. Lower is better. VidIQ combines all this information into an overall score from 1 to 100. The best thing to do here is to go for low competition and high search volume topics, especially when you're just starting. Yes, how I make tutorials that rank on YouTube with vidIQ. I start by typing out my video's topic on the YouTube search bar. YouTube suggests popular titles, so I write this down. Then I search these titles on vidIQ and pick the tags with the lowest competition and the highest search volume. I use two of these tags to create a clear video title and put the rest into the video description. This ensures that when users search for a particular topic, my videos show up in the results. A catchy thumbnail ensures that they click on my video and a good intro ensures that they keep watching, theoretically of course. VidIQ also has other cool features like the AI coach which answers your YouTube related questions and the AI content generator which helps you create video scripts and thumbnails. Just know that these tools are still in testing so they may not produce high quality results yet. So which 
VidIQ plan do I recommend? I use VidIQ Boost now, but the free VidIQ Basic is a great start. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and if you have any question, ask in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.